Welcome to the channel. Today our topic is Hubble Telescope and Galaxies. The Hubble Space Telescope is a large telescope in space. It was launched into orbit by Space Shuttle Discovery on April 24, 1990. Hubble orbits about 547 kilometers, 340 miles, above Earth. It is the length of a large school bus and weighs as much as two adult elephants. Hubble travels about 5 miles per second, that is like traveling from the eastern coast of the United States to the western coast in 10 minutes. Hubble is solar-powered. Hubble takes sharp pictures of objects in the sky such as planets, stars and galaxies. Hubble has made more than 1 million observations. These include detailed pictures of the birth and death of stars, galaxies billions of light years away, and comet pieces crashing into Jupiter's atmosphere. Scientists have learned a lot about the universe from these pictures. Many of them are beautiful to look at. A galaxy is a huge collection of gas, dust, and billions of stars and their solar systems, all held together by gravity. We live on a planet called Earth that is part of our solar system. But where is our solar system? It's a small part of the Milky Way galaxy. A galaxy is a huge collection of gas, dust, and of stars and their solar systems. A galaxy is held together by gravity. Our galaxy, the Milky Way, also has a in the middle. When you look up at stars in the night sky, you're seeing other stars in the Milky Way. If it's really dark, far away from lights from cities and houses, you can even see the dusty bands of the Milky Way stretch across the sky. There are many galaxies besides ours, though. There are so many, we can't even count them all yet. They looked at a small patch of space for 12 days and found 10,000 galaxies, of all sizes, shapes, and colors. Some scientists think there could be as many as galaxies in the universe. Some galaxies are spiral-shaped like ours. They have curved arms that make it look like a pinwheel. Other galaxies are smooth and oval-shaped. They're called elliptical galaxies. And there are also galaxies that aren't spirals or ovals. They have irregular shapes and look like blobs. The light that we see from each of these galaxies comes from the stars inside it. Sometimes galaxies get too close and smash into each other. Our Milky Way galaxy will someday bump into Andromeda, our closest galactic neighbor. But don't worry. It won't happen for about 5 billion years. But even if it happened tomorrow, you might not notice. Galaxies are so big and spread out at the ends that even though galaxies bump into each other, the planets and solar